Hey everybody. Been a while, I know. <laughs> Been real busy. just got G, C, D, E minor, F. So let's go through them. G, everybody knows. C. Okay. Index finger at the second string, first fret. Middle finger at the second fret, fourth string. Third finger at the first fret, second string. That's a C. D is going to be index finger at the third string, second fret. Middle finger at the second string third fret and either your ring or your pinky I use my pinky um, at the first string fourth fret alright E minor is just a C taken off the index finger that's an E minor just get your C take off your index finger E minor alright now here comes the hard one F all right, index finger at the first fret of the second string, middle finger at the second fret of the third string, ring finger at the third fret of the fourth string, and your pinky finger, stretch it down there at the first string, uh, third fret there. And that's your F. And you know, to get your transitions, you're just gonna have to practice. I mean, just go real slow between your transitions. So, your chords are just 
right there all right all you're doing is G C and D on your verses all right when you get to your chorus here's what the chorus sounds like E minor rocky top you D always be here comes the hard one F home sweet home to me is C me G, C, Rocky Top, D, Tennessee, back to G, we'll do that again, Rocky Top, you'll always be home sweet home to me, good old Rocky Top. Notice something when I do when I'm getting ready to do that F, I put my hand in that F position real close to them strings before it's time to get over there, right? As quick as I can. Um, if you can do it in the air, you can do it on your banjo, and it just takes some time to get you know, you just have to practice it, all right? But if you're doing real slow like that, rocky time, you. Got it. Home sweet home to me. I'm totally screwing it up now, but to me, can't do it that slow. But if you're practicing it real slow like that and you know looking at your your sheet with your lyrics and your chords on it, then you'll be able to do it, okay? You just go real slow and do those transitions. What I'm doing for most of this song is I'm rocking back and forth on my third and fourth like I always do. And I'm, I'm throwing in some hammer-ons. Um, I'm even doing some hammer-ons with the F. But that's a little more, you know, that, that might be a little harder for you if you're not used to that F chord. Um, and then on the break, what I'm doing is I'm playing, I'm, I'm only on two strings. I'm on my second string and my third string. Real easy, alright? So we're just going to walk up our string nice little break all right so we uh, we're starting out on our second string we just go zero one two three all right so that's and all I'm doing is I'm walking up of the third string and then open so
Then it goes back to um, the third string at the second fret. Down in the Tennessee. And then third string open. Hills. Down in the Tennessee hills. The second part just starts out the same. Instead of doing your, um, you're doing, um, instead of that, you're doing. start into your song again. It's real simple. Um, now there's lots of other ways to play that song. Don't get locked into it, but I'm just showing you a real easy break um, for that. You can play it on all over the neck on different strings. That's just a real simple one using those two strings. Okay, um, so there's plenty of free there's there's free lyrics and chord sheets out there for you. I'm just using the one that's got G, C, D, E minor, and F in it. Okay, um, so I'm not going to take anybody else's material to to give it to you when you can find it out there. But anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed that, and I hope you get something out of it. And excuse my singing for it. I don't usually sing that, but anyway, y'all have a great day.